the end of the day when you're capturing a giraffe, you're just focused. It's all about having that giraffe come down safely and get up safely. I'm just totally focused. Although many of the team are wild animal vets, few have actually touched a giraffe before, like Dr. Eddie Kambale. I'm really very excited to work with a giraffe for my first time since I was born. I just used to read books, but now I'm feeling the reality of what it means being or working with a giraffe. We have few of them, so we need to keep some. Yeah, yeah, good. To push blood up their huge necks to their brains, giraffes have the largest hearts of all land mammals. It can weigh over 20 pounds and beats twice as fast as our own. When it was running, the heartbeat was much higher. But right now, it's settling down, so the rate has reduced. How's the breathing there? It's good. The breathing is fine, and it's very regular. It's a very relaxed giraffe. Emotionally, for me, I feel attached. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. OK, everyone, I think let's let the animal properly stand up. Let it get up strongly onto its feet before we start to pull it. Huh? Catching the giraffe, you know, it's something that I learned from uh, Pete. You know, if he says things can be done, you do it. And you're out there and you're there for the giraffe. Giraffes use their powerful necks to batter other giraffes. But Julian has to stay close to stop the giraffe from hurting itself. When it's down, you know, you sort of, okay, quick rush, let's get all the things done, let's make it safe, let's make it sound. And you're just waiting for that moment to get up safely. 